you might be asked to multiply 2 times 0 0.5. So we have a whole number and we have this decimal. And here's a few ways to think about that. First of all, you could just, on your calculator, you could multiply 2 times 0 0.5 and you'll end up with 1.0 or maybe just 1 by itself. So that's the first way to do it. 2 times 0 0.5 on your calculator, it'll give you 1. Another way to think about that is we have two of these 0.5s. So we could say we have one, two, two of these 0.5s, so we could just add them together. 0.5 plus 0.5, that just equals one, or you could call it 1.0. So that's another way to think about it. We get the same answer. Finally, you could multiply two times 0.5. 2 times 5, that's 10, and then 2 times 0, that's not anything. We have this one decimal place here, one decimal place here, and again, 2 times 0 0.5, that's 1.0. You could just call it 1. This is Dr. V multiplying 2 times 0 0.5. The answer is 1. Thanks for watching.